We move to another saxophone that we want to talk about. With me are Rolf Henrichs again and Chris Dunkley. Good morning. It's the 82Z series that we want to talk about, and it's a very special year for the series. Chris, what is it with it? Well, uh, this year is the 10th anniversary of our custom series of saxophones, so that's EX and Z. So for Z model, we've got a brand new model coming out this year, which is really, you know, it's quite a significant step forward. Um, we've made a lot of good changes, and we've had some really good feedback from artists and players who've tried it. It's made a real difference to the freedom of the sound and the playability, and yeah, we're really excited about this. Rolf, can you give us the details to what you changed? Yes, of course. Uh, we did quite a lot on this uh, instrument, which was quite good before, but uh, the taste has changed over the years, and uh, so we gave him more expression, more, more sound um, uh, possibilities. It starts all with the neck, which is uh, improved, and the main improvement I would think is that we give him a uh, hand hammered one piece bell now as we had it on the EX saxophones only in the past which um, gives a much more free sound uh, especially in the lower register around this corner here but it affects the sound of, of the whole instrument and the other significant uh, step is Yamaha never did metal resonators on the, on the pads. Uh, we simply didn't do it over, over all the years, but uh, uh, the metal resonator has a quicker um, response and uh, sounds a little bit more bright, it gives, gives a little bit more brightness in the sound and it makes it much quicker in, in, in response, as I said. And, and this together, those um, handmade bell and the metal res resonators and, and the neck ma makes it much more open uh, to, to change the sound colors by the musician. Um, with all the things you changed and improved, is it an instrument more for top level players or also for beginners? Yes, of course. This is an instrument which is made for top level players and we, we would even say, although we, we never have uh, this category, categorizations. It is more for, for a jazz-oriented player uh, who, who really uh, works more with sound colors as the classical players do. All right. Well, is there anything to add? Some f uh, smaller things we as well added. Um, for instance, an adjustment of, of the high F key here with a screw here at this side. So you can, um, you can adjust how much this key opens. For some players that is important when they are playing in the high register that some notes might speak better if, if the hole is more or less open and, and so they can adjust uh, personally. And the other thing is that we also did a new engraving on, on the bell here. <laughs> Very pretty. <laughs> and the, uh, as you might not know, this is really made by hand. The engraving is not laser, it is really made by hand. As so it takes a while to, to make one of those. They are quite quick with that, but uh, it is a hard work and needs a real specialist. <laughs> <laughs> so a special saxophone um, that has new improvements now. And if you want to have more information about what is new, just visit our website europe.yamaha.com. Bye-bye from here. Thank you for your information.